it was 4 or 3 in the morning, and I woke up screaming. It was my dream. I watched everyone I ever knew or loved be killed by the creature. It had a short, fat body and long, slender arms, which ended with claws that looked more like swords than claws. Its eyes were slits that glowed red in the darkness, and its teeth were long like horns and sharp like steak knives. It looked at me before it killed them and laughed each time before it ripped apart my loved ones with its sharp claws. How had it found us? It tricked me into letting it into my home by mimicking the voice of my father. It couldn't come in without permission, it told me, after it ripped out my mother's heart. The dream ended with the creature laughing its evil cackle and slowly walking towards me, dragging its claws on the floor. I screamed and sat up. I was in my room, in my bed, safe again. 403. I hear a knock at my door. I froze instantly. Morgan? I heard you screaming. Are you all right? I heard my mom say, what a relief. Mom's here. I'm fine, mom. Just a bad dream. I replied, the relief washing over me. Okay, honey. I got a glass of water. Do you want it? Mom said back to me. Sure, come in. I said. And as those words left my mouth, I remembered that it was October. And I had moved back into my college dorm three weeks ago.